Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we will custom a Windows Server 2019. To install a Windows VPS on DigitalOcean, we need a custom Windows. Actually, we can take from Google, but sometimes the Windows contains virus, contains a mining script, so your Windows VPS on DigitalOcean just stay for about 4 days or 5 days and after that you cannot access the windows we will custom a really windows that i download from microsoft so this is safe let's start come to your digital ocean and create a droplet just choose region where you want for os choose ubuntu version 20 then oh, for CPU options I choose 8 GB RAM for regular then authentication method choose password and create your password after creating a password then just key the host name I give name 1 click create droplet now we need access to root folder. You can use putty or termius or here I will use bitfice. Just copy the IP, then pass on bitfice here, just click login. Accept for this connections, enter the password that you've created. Click OK. Authentication completed. Come to new terminal console. Yes, we have already come to root folder. Now, for the first step, download and install the installer file. Just copy, pass here, enter. Number two, copy, grant execution permission, pass here, enter. Number three, run the installer copy pass enter just waiting if you find this just click enter now you have to choose what windows that you will custom i will choose number two because i want to custom windows server 2019 click enter now Windows has already downloaded it successfully. Time to run KEMU. Key EMU, just copy this one. Don't forget to change this XX to the version of Windows that you custom. And I change the XX with 2019. Come to here, pass, enter twice, enter twice. Now open your real VNC viewer then copy the IP, pass here, and enter. Click continue. We are going to install the windows on KEMU, key EMU. Just like as well, click next. Click install now. Here, I choose Windows Server 2019 standard evaluation with desktop experience. Click next. I accept the license terms, Click next, which is custom or install windows only. Click load driver, click browse, then click Virtio, then click AMD 46, I'm sorry, AMD 64, choose 2K19 like our windows click next then click next after finding unlocated space like this just click next now you create your password for your windows you will use this password to log in to your VPS I will use this password if you don't have any time to custom windows, you can use my windows on the description below 
and you will use this password. Just buy me a coffee. Then click finish. Click CTRL ALT and Dell for this button and enter your password. This is the password I create. The next you must do is enable remote desktop in Windows Server setting. Disable CTRL plus ALT plus Dell in local security and then annex annex. We will do it one by one. Okay here click yes or no, it's up to you. You click don't show this message again, just close. Now come to local server. Now we will make this remote desktops enable. Just click and disable text. Click allow remote connection to this computer. Click OK. Untick this one. Just click apply. Click OK. Slowly you will see this text will be changed to enable. Next click tools. Click local security policy. Click local police. Security options. Just go down and interactive logon do not require CTRL, ILT, and DL. Click twice. Click twice. Change to enable. Click apply. Click OK. Yes, you can close it. Type sleep, power and sleep. Then choose never. Then close. Now come to file explore. Drive A, Virtio. Select all on this drive then copy then come to C on this PC local disk C create a folder create name Virtio or up to you the and pass here pass all of Virtio driver file here this is must because you will need it when you want to connect your VPS Windows to internet. Yes, you have finished all of the step. Just close. You see that you get a license for 180 days. We can close this one. Now we will compress the Windows Server file. Don't forget to change the XX with the version of your Windows. Just copy. I come to Notepad. Change this to 2019. Oh, sorry. Here. The KMU is still active. To deactive this one, just click CTRL and C. Yes, it's terminating on sign out too. Then pass this code here, enter. It's like there is no progress, but actually this is progressing. You just wait for it. It's a little bit longer. A few moment later. Okay, after compressing the file, now we install Apache 2. Apache. Just pass here, enter. Type Y, enter. Okay, finish. Now allow firewall access for Apache. Pass, yeah, finish. Now move this Windows Server file to web directory. Copy. Don't forget. And don't forget to change this one. I change to 2019. Actually, you can do it from this, from SFTP also this one windows 2019 uh, move to move to far and double this one and html move here we will do it with this yes it's already finished just close okay i close it now we can test it just copy then pass here enter yes if you can download it so 
your Windows has been ready. Now come to come to backup and snapshot. Click custom image. Click import via URL. Just pass here. We will install. We will upload the Windows to the Digital Ocean. Click next. Then for distribution, click unknown. Then data center region, you can choose wherever you want. I choose Singapore because this country is nearest country from my country. Click upload image. It will be progressed and it will it will be progressed for about five hours so we will stop this video we continue the next video to install this windows 2019 on the vbs server on digital ocean see you next time oh yeah if you have oh yeah if you don't have time to custom this windows you can use my windows on the description below just buy me a coffee See you next time. Bye-bye.